Dozens of people gathered today at the DeKalb County Courthouse. It was a show of solidarity for the life of Caleb McCall. Some of you might remember this case. McCall, a teenager, was stabbed and killed in September of last year. This morning, the teenager accused of the murder was in court for a hearing. 13 WREX's Emily McMinn has the story. Five months after his death, Friends and family members of Caleb McCall are still mourning the loss. This continued right here today at the DeKalb County Courthouse as they came together to show support and demand the justice they believe should be served. It was a loss to many, not only our family, but other families as well. Over 50 loved ones gathered this morning, all aiming to show support for McCall's family, who say the turnout means a lot. It means a lot that everybody, even like friends and other family members, plus like other people that may have known about Caleb are showing up today. Even in the midst of the gathering, close friends of the McCall family are still trying to wrap their minds around how such a heinous crime could be committed. It was senseless. It was uncalled for. It was unnecessary. It, uh, all of it. that you can think of. Every possible word. For several of McCall's friends who are still teens, the impact Caleb left behind is felt daily. I do about it every day. I just miss talking to him. He was just the one person you would talk to for hours and hours. And despite the negative circumstances leading to today's gathering, McCall's loved ones say their push for justice remains as strong as ever. We are out here for justice for Caleb. We're not going to stop until we get justice. He deserves that. His family deserves that. Reporting in Sycamore, Emily McMinn, 13 WREX. And a GoFundMe page for McCall's funeral expenses has raised more than $23,000 since being published in September. 13 WREX has reached out to the DeKalb County Courthouse for results of today's hearing, but we're still waiting to hear back on that. As soon as we do, we'll share those details with you both online and on our air.